Found a Karen on Facebook Live. Probably 45 minutes of having it on. It's the first time I've worn one. I am disoriented. I'm a little mad, if you can't tell that already. Like, I'm very, I'm, I'm frustrated. About Bro, the new meme for white ladies is like HIPAA violations. It's a violation of my privacy. I wonder if she'll mention it, but there's another video. I have a couple of these uh, Karen vids uh, lined up actually for you guys to watch. I don't feel good physically. Like I can tell you right now, I wasn't getting enough oxygen and I just had on one of these little stupid things. I feel dizzy. My hands are kind of tingly. My heart is beating fast. So some of it's an emotional reaction, but some of it's a physical reaction. I understand the virus is real, okay? I understand the virus is real. Friends, look at the numbers and tell me why everybody's living in fear. Tell me why we're putting these things on and not being able to breathe. I just wanna cry. Like that's all I wanna do is cry because you can't see people's faces. You can't make human connection. We can't hug people. We can't hold their babies. I'm at the end of it. I'm just simply at the end of it. It doesn't make sense. And it's probably the last time I'm wearing this because I feel terrible. I feel emotionally terrible, but I feel physically like it affected me. So anyway, there you go. I hope in the future there's like an empathy machine People that react this way have to live one day, just one day. You don't love as the spirit a of justice. Poor, you like love your homeless black person or something. Okay, just one fucking day, just 24 hours. You go into the machine, you, you put on, you do a video like this, and immediately the authorities come and they put you in the machine where you live 24 hours as like as a as a fucking homeless black person or. A disabled person you know what i mean like someone who does not have uh, a tremendous profound amount of privilege just one day like what the f uh, like they ask you to put on a f mask for your safety and the safety of others and, and this is how you break down dude you just gotta f see life from other people's uh, point of views man holy f i feel like it'll fix the situation I, I i legitimately do i think all right let's watch this yes, what was that we're sheep <laughs> Thank you for coughing. Bye. Hey, hey, hey. I think if someone does that to you, they are legitimately like, I mean, that's a threat. Like, I, I think that would be protected if you fought that person. Like, I don't know. I, I don't know what the, what the legal grounds are, but I'm sure we'll find out eventually when one of these Karens gets decked out. And it's not just Karens either. There's a lot of, there's a lot of people that are doing this, but one of these people are going to get decked kind of like self-defense not kind of like self-defense you're 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 absolutely we don't know if you have coronavirus or not you're just gonna cough on me what the fuck is that shit hi everyone i work for costco and i'm asking this member to put on a mask because that is our company policy so either wear the mask and or... i'm not doing it because i woke up in a free country have a great day so you're gonna take this car from me. Sir, have a great Pull day. Pull the stuff. You are no longer welcome here in our warehouse. You need to leave. Thank you very here, much. You put it on. I'll give you my card. Bitch. Hey, what's up, bitch? Oh, you're gonna put it on now? Cause you need that toilet paper to wipe your fucking bitch ass, don't you? Yeah. What's up, bitch? Yeah. Put that mask on, pussy. Pussy bitch. Yeah. Get the fuck out of that Costco, mother dude. Oh my god, it makes me so mad. Oh, it makes me so angry. Seeing these pieces of shit harass the f out of these people that are already like literally putting their lives on the line. Grocery store clerks are already in a f***ed up shitty ass f***ing position all the goddamn time, okay? They're getting f***ed on a daily basis when, they're, when there isn't a f***ing pandemic going on. But then on top of that, now they're literally putting their lives on the line. Like they are, they just are. They're putting their safety, they're, they're putting your pleasure and your survival ahead of their own safety and the safety of their families, okay? Because you don't know what the situation is back home for them either. They might get coronavirus and survive, but their parents might not survive if they are there, if they're in the same house, okay? To f treat them like shit because you have to f wear a mask. My God, it is so deeply frustrating to see these privileged pieces of shit, dude.
Hi, I have a medical condition that I'm not allowed to wear a mask, and I'm not required by HIPAA rule, re, rules and regulations to okay. disclose that. Okay, can we shop for you? So, um, what does that look like? We I have private things I want to get that maybe shop, I don't want we you to shop see. For you, but I can't let you in the store without a mask. Okay, so where's the regulations that state that? The regulations? Yeah. That, that it's company. Because you're discriminating against me now. Do you know that? I'm. I'm. I'm you're discriminating you against me. Looks like you're gonna die, bitch. Looks like you and your family are gonna starve today. Okay. Move your HIPAA ass out of the store. How about that? Lying. Oh, I have a HIPAA. I, uh, HIPAA protects me from disclosing what my medical condition is. Like, what the f is your medical condition? You can't wear a mask. It's not a real thing. Oh my lord, dude. Oh goddamn, dude. Here, I have a medical diagnosis. You're a smooth-brained moron. That's my medical diagnosis. But let me tell you something. It does not prevent you from wearing a mask in public. Holy shit. The worst part about this entire thing is that like wearing a mask only lowers the chances by what, like 10 to 30%. It's not even that significant. It's just significant when you look at it uh, as a, when, when everyone follows it as a society, okay? It lowers the, the number of people that you likely are spreading it to. According to Reddit, so it's not even like, it's a tiny a thing that we're river. doing. But it's a tiny thing we that we're doing that. that will help out in the long run and have gigantic consequences. This is why individualism is a problem in society. It, it's not. Certain elements of individualism are beautiful. It's just that the problem is that America has this like really gross outlook on on life. Like American culture is is so f up and so broken. Move to China if you want to force people to wear masks. You f Tommy. Yeah, China is the only country that are forcing people to wear masks, brother. You're right. Keep coping though. I can't wait for the next wave where we all die and like China inevitably takes over the world with ease because of dipshits like that guy who are just like, I don't care. It's my freedom. Like you're killing yourself. You're literally killing yourself. You're killing your family. You're killing your parents. I don't know how you can't see that. Like I, even from a chud point of view, if you didn't want China to take over the world because you know, my freedom or whatever, you should be taking all of the precautions. Like you should be taking every precautionary measure. How are we going to let China beat us? How are we going to let Korea beat us? They're a communist nation. The communist nation is South Korea. How are we going to let them beat us, brothers? You know, you have to wear a shirt and shoes in store that also they won't serve you. What is this? Shirt and shoes? You got to wear a shirt and shoes? What the f*** is this? Communist Russia? What the hell? I'll walk into that goddamn store with my hog out. It's my f***ing right as an American. America, baby. Yeah, I have a medical condition that my dick needs to be out. And also, uh, according to HIPAA, it's a violation. I don't need to disclose what my medical condition is. Craziest Karen so far. What is going on? Like, I mean, this is great, dude. Why are they all white? Is this just a sample bias or is it actually for real? I mean, we've seen like, we've seen uh, uh, like, Black people do some dumb fucking shit too. In Chicago, for example, there was like that fucking house party with like 700 people locked into one fucking house that some dude was live streaming. So it's not just like, it's just Americans doing dumbass bullshit. It's against the law. The ADA tells them that you cannot make people wear a mask. It's not our laws at all. This is just made up by Bill Gates and them and by you wearing that. Seriously, think about it. You're breathing out your toxic air and you're breathing in the same air you're making your lungs you're killing your antibodies she seems so knowledgeable though she seems so scientifically on the ball as they say in the science community and and knowledgeable about the uh, bill gates the real bill gates secret dude honestly facebook was such a mistake what we need to do is like we need to cut off people like this from information we need to like push them to the to the outskirts just feed them, provide all services for them, okay? All matter of services for them. Just like, just push them away. And if you want to go to the happy place, you go to the happy place. You can live there like a hog with other hogs. And, you know, eventually they'll all die because they're not going to actually uh, vaccinate. So, you know, one, one person gets a sickness and then boom, they're wiped out. But like up until that point, it's great. They just all hang out. They just all hang out by themselves. All of their needs are met. And we all just get to do our own thing. All matter of, of communication on the internet has been such a gigantic mistake for these people. I don't know how these people stumble on every single bad take and misinformation. 
I say give up Kentucky. No, Florida. That's it. Push him out to Florida. Because, like, there is the highest amount of those people are in Florida anyway, okay? <laughs> no discrimination. Black, white, doesn't matter, okay? If you're a hog, Excuse you go me. to Florida. I'm sorry. We just I'm push him to Florida. We build a wall around Florida. Perhaps. Go look on the package, and it will tell you it will not protect you from COVID-19. You are hurting yourself. Don't stop being like They want to kill all Do the Do you believe in the COVID? They want to kill all the black people. They want to kill everybody. Watch out what you're being told. You're being lied to. Do you believe in it? Do I believe with the COVID? I yeah. believe there's a virus, but it's not what they say. It's like any other virus. They have 98, 99% cure. 99%. So what kind of a virus is that? But this doesn't control. even make sense. Like, even Trump admits that the death toll would be up to 2 million if we didn't do these measures. Like, so I don't even know who the f*** these people believe anymore. She seems to have a lot of good ideas, okay? That's what I'm... She's being real logical about it. It's all damaging. Look it up for yourself. Go online and look it up. I will. Take my word. Dude, this is a serious problem, dude. There is a serious problem with so many people who have just lost their f***ing minds okay wait is any of that shit true wait what no dude what the f what the f myth what you see like one motherly figure yelling uh, some random numbers out and you're like wait does she have a point is this how it goes myth is this are we finding out how disinformation spreads you don't man you need to get laid brother <laughs> my man blinded by the wagon though what did she say? She said, like, there's a 99% cure rate. First of all, it's a novel virus. So we literally don't know. We do not know if people can get reinfected. There's a likelihood that it can happen. That's one thing. The second thing is there are so many deaths that are attributed to coronavirus, so many additional deaths that you have no explanation for if you don't think it's coronavirus. Like, these people never explain that. And some of them believe it's 5G. I guess some of them like Dr. Disrespect. I bought a whole bunch of Shungite. <laughs> but he's got Shungite, so he's good. Dr. Disrespect's got Shungite, so he's protected. Shungite.